Scene script. Have you ever wondered what mysteries lie beneath the surface of the world's oceans? Let's take a moment to ponder upon this vast liquid expanse that covers over two-thirds of our planet, a world that despite its enormity, remains largely uncharted and unexplored. It's an alien landscape, teeming with life and brimming with secrets right here on Earth. Picture this. The ocean surface is merely a gateway to a realm that stretches down for miles, reaching depths that defy human comprehension. At its deepest point, the Mariana Trench, it plunges down to a staggering seven miles. To put that into perspective, if we were to place Mount Everest at the bottom of this trench, its peak would still be submerged under a mile of water. But it's not just the sheer scale that makes this underwater realm so fascinating. Within its depths, it harbors an incredible diversity of life. From the smallest plankton to the largest whale, the ocean is home to millions of different species, many of which are yet to be discovered. Each one of these creatures plays a critical role in intricate ecosystems, as varied and complex as any found on dry land. Imagine vast forests of kelp swaying in the current, vibrant coral reefs buzzing with activity, and the eerie silence of the deep sea floor. Picture the multitude of creatures that call these places home, the colorful fish darting among the coral, the sea turtles gliding gracefully through the water, and the mysterious creatures lurking in the depths their strange forms illuminated only by the faint glow of bioluminescence. And yet, this underwater realm remains largely a mystery. We've only explored a tiny fraction of the world's oceans, leaving the majority of this vast aquatic wilderness untouched and unobserved. It's a world of endless possibilities waiting to be discovered. So buckle up, as we dive deep into this journey of discovery, into the world beneath the waves. Picture in your mind's eye a vibrant underwater city teeming with life. Welcome to the coral reefs. These are not just colorful spectacles of the ocean but rather bustling centers of marine biodiversity. They are the rainforests of the sea, and they house a myriad of species in their intricate structures. Let's delve into the world of corals. Despite their plant-like appearances, corals are animals. More specifically, they belong to a group called Cnidaria, which also includes sea anemones and jellyfish. Corals come in two main types, hard and soft. Hard corals like brain and staghorn corals build the sturdy limestone foundations of the reef. Their softer counterparts like sea fans and sea whips don't have the same structural role but add to the reef's complexity and beauty. Each coral is made up of hundreds to thousands of tiny creatures called polyps, working together in a communal lifestyle that epitomizes teamwork. They share nutrients and also protect each other, a perfect example of unity and diversity. The coral reefs are not just about the corals themselves, but also about the countless marine species they host. These reefs are bustling with life, from the smallest plankton to the largest fish. Clownfish, butterflyfish, parrotfish, and sea turtles all find shelter and food among the reefs. The dazzling colors and patterns you see are all part of a complex ecosystem where each species has a role to play. Now imagine the corals at night. Many of them transform into flower-like organisms as polyps come out to feed, the reef becomes a completely different world with nocturnal creatures like octopuses and moray eels emerging from their hideouts. Coral reefs are not just ecosystems, they're also protectors. They act as barriers, absorbing wave energy and protecting coastal areas from storms and erosion. They are the unsung heroes of our planet, working tirelessly beneath the waves. Truly, coral reefs are the bustling metropolises of the ocean. Their importance extends far beyond their physical presence. They're a vital part of our world and their health directly impacts the health of our planet. So, let's celebrate these magnificent underwater cities and do all we can to protect them. Now imagine descending deeper where sunlight is a stranger. Welcome to the realm of the deep sea creatures. In this world of perpetual darkness, life takes on a form that's beyond ordinary. The pressure is immense, the temperatures are frigid, and the scarcity of food is a constant challenge. Yet against all odds, life thrives. This survival is due to the remarkable adaptations these deep-sea creatures have developed over millions of years. Take the anglerfish, for example. This peculiar creature has evolved an extraordinary method to lure its prey. Above its mouth hangs a glowing bait, a beacon in the darkness. When an unsuspecting fish is attracted to this light, the anglerfish strikes with a mouth wide enough to swallow prey twice its size. Another fascinating species that resides in these depths is the giant squid. This elusive creature can reach lengths of over 40 feet, making it one of the largest predators in the deep sea. To catch its prey, the giant squid is equipped with two long tentacles, each covered in hundreds of suckers lined with tiny, razor-sharp teeth. 
In the deep sea where food is scarce, many creatures have developed the ability to create their own light. This phenomenon known as bioluminescence serves various purposes. For some, it's a way to attract prey. For others, it's a defense mechanism to blind predators or a means to communicate in the eternal night. The adaptations don't stop there. Some creatures, like the fangtooth fish, have developed oversized teeth and expandable stomachs to capture and consume whatever food they encounter. Others, like the blobfish, have a body density slightly less than water, allowing them to float above the seafloor without expending energy. Each creature in the deep sea is a testament to the remarkable resilience and adaptability of life. They've evolved in ways that challenge our understanding of survival, pushing the boundaries of what's possible in the harshest conditions on Earth. In the darkness of the deep sea, life takes on a whole new meaning. Let us resurface and journey to the temperate coasts. Here we find underwater forests, the kelp forests. These towering structures swaying gently in the ocean currents are not just a spectacle for divers and underwater explorers. Kelp forests play a vital role in the marine ecosystem and the planet as a whole. They are the lungs of the ocean, absorbing carbon dioxide and releasing oxygen, helping to mitigate the effects of climate change. But their importance doesn't stop there. Kelp forests are a bustling hub of biodiversity, providing food, shelter, and breeding grounds for a wide range of marine species. From the tiniest plankton to the largest marine mammals, life thrives in these underwater jungles. One of the most iconic inhabitants of the kelp forest is the sea otter. These charismatic creatures are often seen floating on their backs among the kelp, munching on their favorite snacks of sea urchins and clams. But they're not just cute faces. Sea otters play a crucial role in maintaining the health of the kelp forest. By keeping the population of sea urchins in check, they prevent these grazing animals from devouring the kelp and decimating the forest. Schools of fish dart through the kelp, using the dense fronds as a hideout from predators. Various types of fish, from the brightly colored Garibaldi to the stealthy leopard shark, call these forests home. Even the kelp itself is a marvel. These algae can grow up to 2 feet per day, reaching heights of up to 150 feet. This makes them one of the fastest growing organisms on the planet. So as we drift through these underwater jungles, let's take a moment to appreciate their beauty and significance. They are a testament to the resilience and diversity of life on our planet. They remind us of the delicate balance that exists in nature and our responsibility to protect and preserve it. Kelp forests, the underwater jungles are truly a sight to behold. Now it's time to confront a harsh reality. The underwater world is under threat. From the shallowest coral reefs to the deepest ocean trenches, our human activities are causing profound changes in marine ecosystems. Overfishing, pollution and climate change are among the most pressing issues that they face. Overfishing is more than just the removal of large amounts of fish from the ocean. It's the disruption of a delicate balance that has evolved over millions of years. When we deplete fish populations, we're not just taking food off our plates, but we're also destabilizing the entire marine food web. Predators lose their prey, and species lower down the food chain can multiply unchecked, leading to unpredictable and often disastrous consequences. Then there's pollution. Every year millions of tons of plastic waste find their way into our oceans. This plastic doesn't just disappear, it breaks down into microscopic pieces that can be ingested by marine life causing harm to the creatures that unwittingly consume it. Oil spills, heavy metals and other forms of pollution also take their toll, poisoning marine life and damaging delicate ecosystems. And we can't ignore the elephant in the room, climate change. The oceans absorb vast amounts of the carbon dioxide we emit, which leads to ocean acidification. This phenomenon is literally dissolving the shells of shellfish and bleaching coral reefs. Rising sea temperatures are also causing marine species to migrate to cooler waters, disrupting ecosystems, and leading to a loss of biodiversity. Yet, despite these challenges, there is hope. We have the knowledge and the tools to turn the tide. By managing our fisheries sustainably, reducing our waste and transitioning to a low-carbon economy, we can mitigate these threats and protect our oceans for future generations. The fate of the underwater world lies in our hands. Scene script. Despite the challenges, there is hope. Conservation efforts are underway to protect and restore these precious ecosystems. Let's take a moment to celebrate the victories we've achieved so far. Marine Protected Areas, or MPAs, are a beacon of hope. These are like national parks of the sea, where human activity is limited to allow nature to thrive. 
There are now over 15,000 MPAs worldwide, protecting almost 8% of the ocean. It's not yet the 30% that scientists recommend, but we're making progress. In these safe havens we see marine life rebounding, fish populations are growing, coral reefs are recovering, and endangered species are finding refuge. It's a testament to the resilience of nature when given a chance, but our efforts don't stop there. We're also restoring what's been damaged. Take coral reefs for example. These biodiversity hotspots have been battered by climate change and pollution, but hope is not lost. Scientists and volunteers are growing corals in nurseries and transplanting them onto damaged reefs. It's a painstaking process, but we're seeing results. Reefs are regaining their colors, and life is returning. So, what can you do to help? You might think that the ocean's problems are too big for one person to make a difference. But remember, the ocean is made up of drops, and every drop counts. You can start by reducing your carbon footprint, walk more, drive less, choose renewable energy, eat less meat, you can also reduce, reuse, and recycle to limit pollution. And if you live near the coast, why not join a beach cleanup or volunteer at a local marine conservation project? Remember, every action matters, no matter how small. It's our collective efforts that will turn the tide. Together, we can ensure that the mysteries of the underwater world continue to fascinate future generations. Our journey through the underwater world is coming to an end. We've journeyed through the vast and mysterious deep blue, from the vibrant coral reefs teeming with life, to the enigmatic depths where curious creatures make their home. We've walked through underwater forests, a spectacle of marine life that rivals the most diverse rainforests on land. We've also seen how this world, as diverse and beautiful as it is, bears the scars of human impact. Pollution, climate change, overfishing, these are just a few of the challenges facing our oceans. But we've also seen hope. We've seen how conservation efforts, scientific research, and individual actions can make a difference. So, as our journey ends, let's take with us not only the wonder of the underwater world, but also the responsibility we share. Remember, every drop in the ocean counts, and so does every action we take. Keep exploring, keep learning, and most importantly, keep caring for our blue planet.